So for today request a comparison of the iPhone SE third generation versus Samsung Galaxy A53. Now let's begin. Screen type. Samsung Super AMOLED display, iPhone IPS. Refresh rate Samsung again with a faster 120 Hz. The 60 Hz in the iPhone. Pixel density. Same with the Samsung. And resolution, you have a fully HD in the Samsung while HD screen in the iPhone. And the screen size, yeah, the iPhone is very small, 4.7 inches. Samsung 6.5 inches, that's big. And the protection, the iPhone has a better protection. The glass is super strong. Gorilla Glass 5 in the Samsung, not bad. The screen type definitely is Samsung, super AMOLED display. Processor iPhone 3.23, trust me that's fast. So the chipset, that's the Apple A15 chipset, the Bionic. Samsung Exynos 1280 chipset, no comparison. The GPU again, the Apple GPU, trust me that's a beautiful graphics there. The iPhone is taking the win. For the system, iOS, better security than Android. The battery. You have the bigger 5000 milliamp in the Samsung. To have a longer lasting battery life. Fast charging 25 watt in the Samsung, 20 watt in the iPhone. The performance in this iPhone is no doubt like the iPhone 13. For the camera, for the main camera, you have a 12 megapixel compared to the 64 megapixel in the Samsung. The A53 has an ultra wide marker and depth sensor. The iPhone only has one rear camera. So you decide which one is better. I'm going for the Samsung. Video recording both can do 4K up to 30 frames per second. For the selfie camera, you have a 7 megapixel, 32 megapixel in the Samsung. Both aperture are the same. In video recording, iPhone crappy full HD camera while the Samsung giving you 4K. Samsung has a better camera storage so there's no memory card supported in the iphone while in the samsung yes up to one terabyte and ufs the iphone is pretty fast but for the ram the samsung is coming with a 8 gig while the iphone has a 4 gig ram and the storage both can go up to 256 gig of storage so you have a lot of storage for your files but the Samsung has a better storage overall design. So the weight, I didn't know this iPhone is light, so it's gonna come in at 144 gram. While the Samsung is slightly on the heavier side. IP resistance, both are IP67. And earphone jack, they are not supported, but as you know, both can use a adapter. Same for radio, it is not supported in either of them. And NFC, yes. You know you have to make your payment, right? So you need the NFC. And for fingerprint, there is no question here. The better is in display screen. Touch sensor, touch ID will go eventually. Bluetooth, Samsung again with a faster 5.1, while an iPhone 5.0. The better design, I'm definitely giving it to the Samsung for the results. Again, the Samsung is cheaper than the iPhone. So the winner go to the Samsung. Even though the iPhone has a better performance, the Samsung has a better screen, better camera, better storage option, and a better design. Comment below which video you want me to do next. See you in the next one, guys.